and get the hell out of there kind of thing. Yeah, I was. And um, yeah, just on that run, I've been like, it's pretty sick, eh? It'd be mean for sand dunes. Yeah, yeah, and a boogie down here. Right, good morning, everybody. It's been a hot trick, and we're at Cape Maria Van Diemen. I got. The buddy Chase here is just taking a leap. Um, we've only got one board on us today. This was a little trip I've been planning for the last couple of weeks. Um, conditions look pretty, pretty bloody favourable. Like I said, we've only got one board. Chase hasn't skimmed before, so this is going to be hilarious. <laughs> and now uh, we're just we're just going to get in there and have a little run around and enjoy the day because she's just superb. Yeah! <laughs> 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 oh, look at that! Oh, yeah! Uh, yeah, we actually skimmed it that Easter because it was it was quite flat. It was okay, but it's not not the skim side. Yeah, she's a good pump for the legs too, eh? Yeah, this is the degree of a roof. <laughs> Alrighty, back from Cape Maria Van Diemen, it is your 1.50 update from the afternoon. We're going for a little dive now, I think Chase enjoyed this morning, big big mission all round, wasn't it? Yeah, mission yeah. but nonetheless rewarding. Didn't, <laughs> didn't break himself out there, so it's a positive from that. Yeah. Um, I think well, we're just going to go get in the water now and uh, hopefully get a feed. <laughs> the conditions are not looking great in fact they're looking probably far from great but um you know we'll see how we go and hopefully 
hopefully put something together and then um, give you a full update a bit later. So the first bloody ball's up for the divers bringing two left-handed gloves down <laughs> and not being bothered to go back. <laughs> so we've got this one on the wrong way. <laughs> Holy shit, well we should have listened to our gut on that one. We've only been out like, I don't know, half an hour or something. It, I don't know what we're doing, really. That's about all I have to say. How was that there, mate? It was a bit rough. <laughs> That last set when we came in, I felt the surge and I like turned around and I'm just like, you're just like, oh dear. <laughs> yeah. Diving down was definitely the option. Yeah. And I went down and I was like, where's my gun? Because it's all stirred up in the sand and oh shit. But you live, you learn, don't you? Alrighty, so it's pretty much bedtime Saturday night. Very long day. Walking out to Cape Maria Van Diemen is probably about uh it's close to 15 kilometers return trip walking plus the skimming obviously and then plus a pretty bloody average dive i obviously over enthusiastic dive this afternoon um big ups to chase for giving it a crack today pretty much the hardest flipping conditions you'll ever face hands down to learn how to get on a skim board um cape maria van diemen itself for any of you guys out there who skim is today it's really hard to document the footage properly unless we can get a crew out there which is probably never going to happen but um today reaffirmed it to me as really the best wave skim we've got anywhere in the country there were waves coming through today that were very 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 good for skimboarding and it's it's hard to um get used to it because it's it's like it's challenging it's dangerous and it's just conditions that we're not really used to in New Zealand it's proper wave skim I do rate the spot incredibly highly um, and lastly of course what is happening in the world right now is, is obviously probably going to affect every single one of us in some way or the other it is a huge thing I've been completely uh, amazed by the news and all this stuff of the coronavirus i think the whole the whole world is going to get a very 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 big shake up new zealand i mean it's saturday night here you're not going to see this video for a few days i won't give you statistics right now because it's going to be completely different by the time the video goes live but um you know for our for myself being up in the north is kind of a bit of a blessing um and our jobs currently we're fine there being um in the school system so um we're pretty happy we're, we're under not too much uh in particular financial pressure from any any way because it's we're just lucky to have a, a job that isn't gonna suffer too badly um i don't know but it's just a huge thing and i mean i'd like to get a few extra opinions i've obviously spoken to a few people i'm amazed by what is going on i can't believe it i don't find it particularly scary i just find it amazing um it is it is yeah it is not a good thing um but it is a new thing and it may change the way the world functions for years to come so um feel free to you know drop a comment or share your story down below in the comments that's it on sam price i'll see you at the beach